Hello folks, Sanford, Florida, Guana and Tortoise Breeders again. This is an informational video. And what I really want to show you here is pyramiding in Aldabra tortoises. When uh, we have a, a hatchling, this guy is about six inches, uh, Aldabra tortoise here. And you can see he has a significant amount of pyramiding. If you actually measure between the valley and the peaks, it's uh, about three eighths of an inch. And uh, again, this guy is six inches. Now this is one that I've actually uh, raised that looked like this, something something like this, uh, back when he was six inches. And you can see he has retained some of those bumps. And that's what they, this is 32 years old, and that's possibly what he could look like 32 years from now. I want to take you over and show you another tortoise. Also had some pyramiding. This is, uh, this is Oliver. And if you look at his points, you see, they're, they're not as pronounced. There's quite a difference between the valley and the peak, but overall, he's a beautiful looking animal and everybody comments on what, you know, what a great animal he is, even though he started off six inches with a bit of pyramiding. This tortoise, in addition to that, has a split skew. If you back up a little bit, Mario, and take a look here, you know, everybody gets, uh, everybody talks about split skew, double skew, what it all means. This is a split skew tortoise and um, pretty insignificant when they're this size, as opposed here to, this is a perfect skew right here. So one other, one other example I want to make over here is with a, um, with a Galapagos. Here, you want to just secure that fellow and we'll head over here. Again, this is another example of a tortoise that I'm actually going to include in this video. I'm going to uh, give you a picture of what, it, what, what he was like when he was six inches, and you'll absolutely, absolutely be amazed at, at where he came from and where he is. Today, he has a beautiful set shell. Yeah, we can see a couple of those points, but you take a look at tortoises today, and there's a lot of tortoises have significantly more pyramiding. This is, this does not look like a deformity. It's not a distraction. So with proper diet and proper care, you can take those animals, even if they have pyramiding and get them, get them pretty smooth over time. So give it a look. Let me know what you think of the video. Leave some comments and please subscribe to the channel. It helps. Thanks a lot, folks.